What about Phil, Phil Jackson, the Zen master? Uh, he was a bit unorthodox in his coaching ways. Uh, I'm sure there were, you know, the, there are awesome stories uh, about him in practice and, you know, off the court. Can you perhaps share a few anecdotes about him from that year? Yeah, you know what I liked about Phil? He was different from anybody I had been around uh, because, like you said, he's a Zen master. But more importantly, he's a guy that makes you think. You know, like you, uh, he, you know, he might have you stand in a circle before practice start and, and close, just close your eyes, you know, close your eyes and, and think about this or think about that. Um, so, and I, I had never, ever been around a coach like that. And it's, it's, and it's funny now, um, I do things to kind of, I'm not going to say challenge my guys, but I do things to make my guys think. Uh, and they don't know why I'm doing it. Uh, but, you know, I, you know, again, you take, bits and pieces from from different people that you've been around and feel um again he 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 knew each and every one of his players and he knew uh what it took to get the most out of the guys that he were he was around and mm -hmm. i and i can appreciate that from what from him mm -hmm. I know um, when uh, actually Kukoc was uh, was cited saying that um Phil Jackson would give each of his players a book Mm -hmm. every year and then he would talk to you about the book did this happen with you as well or uh that didn't happen that that mm -hmm. part didn't happen i know that that was that was talked about during the, the uh, micro's little series he had yeah but no that 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 didn't happen uh he might have gave given us i'm sorry giving us some assignments to do but he never not my group not when mm -hmm. i was there i never had a book that i had to read and come back and give like a book report i've mm -hmm. never had that <laughs>